Hello guys, coming to you from a very chilly Missouri. It is like 46 degrees today. I'm cold, but welcome to Cooking with Camilla. <laughs> About to heat up the kitchen. <laughs> mm. um, today I am making uh, crab mac and cheese, baked crab mac and cheese. It's going to be so good. Um, I'm making it with, I swear I cannot remember what to say today. Uh, okay, start over. Uh, making baked <laughs> crab mac and cheese with some Cajun and Old Bay seasoning. I saw this recipe on uh, Instagram, so I'm going to tweak it a little bit and make it the way I want it to. Um, so hopefully it's going to be really good. Uh, it's a really quick meal. It's not healthy, so, you know, this is supposed to be like healthy cooking mostly, but best believe I'm going to treat you guys every once in a while. So this is a treat for the weekend. <laughs> all right, so let's get started. All right, so this is literally all that we need for the mac and cheese. Um, like I, oh, actually, I did not say that, but... <clears throat> Um, so I'm using the imitation crab meat that you can get from literally any grocery store. I got this from Aldi. Um, so this is like a balling on the budget kind of meal. <laughs> um, you can definitely, obviously, substitute for real crab if you have some. If you have, um, uh, if you have that available. Uh, I'm just doing this to keep the cost down, and I want to see how it comes out. And I am balling on a budget right now. So that's it. Um, so we're gonna need some evaporated milk, um, the pasta shells, you can use any pasta you like, I just like the shells when I do mac and cheese, some chicken broth, obviously the cheese, onion, and the seasoning. So this is gonna be, I know this is gonna be good, I'm just excited, so let's go. Alright, so I just chopped up some onions, so we're gonna put them in the pan, um, and fry those up first. some Cajun Old Bay Now, oh goodness. Whew. Now all we gotta do is just wait for the onion to brown before we pour in the chicken broth and evaporated milk. So we're gonna just wait a few minutes. All right. So now I'm gonna put in um, chicken broth with the evaporated milk. Say hi. <laughs> like that and then two cans of um, evaporated milk which I have never used before so I'm excited to see how this turns out So now that is in, now we want to put some more Old Bay in here, or some more seasoning of everything, I guess. Okay, 
region. And some pepper. Oh. All right. Now time to put in the pasta. Ideally, you want to have like a flat um, pan or pot, like a Dutch oven, but I don't have that, so we're going to just make this work. You know, that's what we got to do. Alright, so now this is going to boil or get to a boil and just simmer for 10 minutes. And we can put in the crack. Mm -hmm. Starting to boil. And just keep moving the pasta around so nothing gets stuck on the bottom. All right, so now I'm just gonna put in um, the cheese, turn off the pan. If I can get this open. No big deal. All right, here we go. So pour some of that in. And you can use any cheese that you like. So I'm gonna do that, Kobe Jack, and then Sharp cheddar because I love ch ch cheddar ah. alright like that oh 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 let's just fold this in Last but not least, we're going to put in our crab. Right, start with that. Goodness. Super creamy. We 
just got to put it in the oven pan. <laughs> Alright, so now let's put this all into the oven pan. <laughs> you gotta have muscles with this. Woo! <gasps> Now we gotta finish off with some cheese on top. Just a little bit. And that's it. Now it's going into the oven. <laughs> so now we're gonna put like a mini facial right here. Open up the pores. Ball on a budget. <laughs> All right, <laughs> let's put this mix in the oven. And it's gonna be in the oven for 10 minutes on 375 before it's done. Then we can feast. <laughs> All right, you know what time it is. It is reveal time. Oh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Mm. It smells amazing. Um, I tried it too, and it tastes equally as good. So um, that is a success, I must say. Super quick. Um... Like I said, you only, you boil the pasta for like 10 minutes in the pan and pour, stir in the sauce, I mean, what the heck? Blah, 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 blah. Stir in the cheese and the crab when the pasta is done. And then you just pour it in the, oh my gosh. Then when you've, my gosh, mix in the cheese and the crab, you just put it in a little pan Put that in the oven for 10 minutes and that's done so literally took me like 30 minutes tops by chopping the onion and everything so super easy to make you should really try it out um cajun you can use cajun if you want or not but definitely use old bay i would say because it came out with the crab so make sure that you let me know what you think if you like this video the recipe Give me a thumbs up and I'll see you next time. Bye.